Hello, and welcome to Let's Play Grand Fantasia. This is the first episode of my Let's Play, although I've, I've tried recording this several times. Let's hope this time works, and I hope everyone enjoys this Let's Play. Okay, so we'll create a character. Name him N-A-D-R-O-J-A, Nat Raja. Give him those eyes look good, make his irises light blue, his hair like this color. I've already tried this several times, so I know what I want. And skin as I'm rather albino. Hold on, not completely albino. My skin's sort of pink and tannish. Okay, let's name our sprite Jaw. This class is going to be uh, a blood hammer because they make armor for warriors and uh, I'm going for a paladin, so he'd be able to make armor for me. Let's change his style, make him like this, give him these really detailed eyes, make his skin red, and we can get started. We get this opening cutscene. It's not really that interesting, basically, this guy, this little sprite, tells us that we're a sprite messenger, and we have to save the world with the help of our little sprite dude here, and monster- oh, these are sprites, and these are monsters who take over the world every once in a while, and sprite messengers like us have to uh, combat them and defeat them. And he's just gonna, in the end, turn our little sprite into a gem that he lives in, and he keeps him in. Okay, I can just... Yeah, we have to help him grow strong. Okay, I'll just skip the video and... Okay, let's get right into it. And a loading screen. Okay, and we gotta go talk to Bamba. Who's this guy? A lot of people here today, more than there was before when I was doing this. We call it Bamba. Okay, so he'll give us this thing for our sprite. And he just did give us that. So now we gotta kill 10 jelly rabbits. Okay, let's get doing this. So in this game, you start out as a novice, and that's basically your class for the first five levels. Alright, I keep forgetting about this. So in your bag, you start out with this card. And when you open it, you get all this nice stuff, including a skill book, where if you've got a little bit of money, you can uh, learn the first two skills. And now that I have strike one, I can press K and go into my skill menu. Take this. Take this. Take this, I won't be needing any of those. And put in strike one. Or, I guess it's just called Strike, it's a level 1 strike. Like, this is Sand Soul Curse 1. And, okay. Let's get fighting these monsters. And this we can't open until we're at level 5. And let's put this in our sprite's little helm. Doesn't do anything, that one, but more will do things. Make him collect. Make him do hunting, because hunting is... We need a lot more of stuff for the first crafting items in hunting than we do in mining. Let's get to some grinding. It takes him relatively short time to get back from his ventures. Oh, I forgot to... Let's go. I keep pushing the wrong button to pick stuff up. There's a guy, black sheep, over there fighting. Getting this undigested grass from these jelly rabbits. It's, it's weird that we stand right on the enemy when we're attacking them. Sora, I haven't showed off these attacks yet. They're a bit overpowered, so they, uh... They really just are a waste, because I can take out these jelly rabbits fine with my basic attack. So we'll take this getting the wonder sprite thing, 
but basically we have to pick one of these to do, and we pick Hunting Gracchus, because we've already made Center Guy Hunting, and what do you know, he's back from hunting, and he'll give us uh, these fur, and then we talk to this guy, Hunting Gracchus, and we get to choose this physical attack card, or a magic attack card, I'm gonna pick the physical emblem. Then we give it to our sprite. We give this to him too, so put this here, and this here, and there we go, that's a bit it for now, so then let's send our sprite to do some more hunting. I don't know why everyone was sitting down to regenerate their health. Maybe they attracted too many jelly rabbits, although I don't see how that could happen considering they don't aggro. I wonder if enemies later will aggro or if they just stay walking around and you attack them. I hope they'll aggro later on. That's a bit of danger to the game. But yeah, all my all my skills are gonna be overkill on these uh, jelly rabbits right now. Oh, and I've gotten more in my skill book. I'll just put this down in my here. So get the this and this. And now we yeah, have more about those. Okay, in this game there's no skill points. Instead, you learn skills by paying money once you've met the objective. Okay, now we gotta go talk to a guy in the next town for uh, getting these pants, and we gotta help him out. So, these are our skills. Let's see where our talents are. We don't have talents. We don't have an ultimate. Uh, let's check our character. You can have a costume, so you can equip different stuff than you're wearing. But, we just got some gloves, so let's put those on. Does that show here? No. Here, it'll show. See, we got these nice gloves now. Okay, and our sprite is finished collecting more fur. Just send them to one more. Oh, I think we might... We... Okay. Oh, right, I have to click this first. Okay. Send him on one more hunting expedition. And then we'll send him mining, and then we'll be able to craft something. Preferably some boots, because we're about to get pants, so... Yeah, a lot of jelly rabbits over here. Let's see, where are we supposed to go? A nice feature in this game is, uh... You can... You can just click on the map, and your character will go somewhere, so if I open my map, we're supposed to go to, uh, to a Ludman, and this is Lud- ugh. Oh. Shoot. Ludman? Nope, right, pushed the wrong place. Shoot. Okay, this is Ludman. We got a left click. So yeah, I'm gonna go for a Paladin once I- Get my class change. Let my buddy finish collecting some stuff. And this is where we'll teleport now that. Oh, he's back. Let's just set. make this our soul preservation point so we'll teleport back here if we die or use our soul teleportation thing. Oh, we get an event. Ideas of the sprite. Oh, so he's giving us a present. Okay, let's make him collect from the mines. Then we'll make him make some warrior equipment when he gets back. Ludman is over here. He'll want us to hunt some stuff, probably. Well, I know, because I've had been here before on my failed runs. Uh, yeah, he wants us to... Okay, so now we get those pants. He's like, oh, you've been sent to help us. Okay, help hunt these monsters, and we're gonna get these when we're done. 
Yeah, it seems a bit of a waste to make boots, but hey. Okay. So we gotta defeat five laughing crabs and smile five smiling crabs. Okay, our guy's not back yet, but we do have some pants we can wear. Let's see these new pants. They're a bit different. They got a different pattern on them, but they're about the same length. Let's kill this laughing. If you're the right level, at least in this early area, I'm pretty sure, then these monsters shouldn't pose any threat to you. Oh, and I get... He's back. Okay, let's make some warrior equipment. Make some... Uh, oh, we don't have enough animal for that. Let's make these trainee boots before we get them. Oh, and... He's making them, okay. So it takes time to make them. I haven't gone. I haven't gotten that far yet. Let's see if he. Let's just wait here while he's doing that. Oh, that was a good battle. Okay, let's kill a smiling crab. This attack. Oh, I accidentally did the wrong click shoot. It's confusing that this game doesn't. This is the touching master. I have succeeded in completing the mission you gave me. Okay, let's make him collect some more stuff from the mines. And let's equip these boots. Thank you. Oh, they take level 6 to equip, darn it. Okay, so I guess those are different than what we're about to get. Try out some of these abilities. There's this, which is like a sand attack, and there's. Oh, I just wasted that. No, I didn't. It didn't use it because I didn't have a target. Let's try this. It's like a special attack, and it's a bit of an AOE. Uh, I keep doing the wrong click because I'm used to playing Guild Wars 2. Which I probably won't do a Let's Play of because there's way too many of those. I don't know what this auto teleport does. It might automatically teleport us to quests. Oh, and our sprite is back. Okay, let's make him. What's this uh, magic alchemy? Okay, more alchemy. Let's chat with him. Some alchemy, maybe? Oh, we can make stuff here, okay. Oh, I don't think we can do that yet, though. Oh, Sprite Sturdy Trousers. What level are these for? Oh, okay. So let's just... We can collect some more mining stuff. We gotta talk to Ludman and talk to Bamba for the Day of Destiny. And the Starlight Seaweed Quests. Okay, so then we're gonna get some boots we can equip. And this is, I think, yeah, it's a consumable biscuit thing. Okay, so they don't have to worry about those crabs anymore. This will we just talk to him again. Oh, we gotta talk to Moo or Moo Ha, I guess. Okay, what did we just get? We got some pants. Let's or no, we got some shoes. Sorry. Okay, let's see what those are. Yeah, nice. I think our shorts are a bit too short though. To be pants. So where is this guy? On him? Yeah, it is. He's got the quest item that it said. And our sprite is back. In my opinion, he comes back way too soon. Maybe that's because I'm used to the 
alchemy in Dragon Quest VIII. It's sort of what this is like. You have something passively do something. Learn skills. Okay. One day you might even become the strongest. Yeah. Okay, so what does he want us to do? Okay, we have to kill Guardian Soldier Bill. Oh, we haven't upgraded our skills in a while. And now we can, I think. Because we're level 4. Oh, I don't know why I clicked that. I could have just clicked here. Okay, let's upgrade this and this. It's nice that enemies drop gold. Or maybe it's just that I'm getting it from my sprite coming back. I'm not sure. Oh, we have to talk to Bill. I thought it was a... I thought it was an enemy. <laughs> What's this? this day of destiny talking to Bamba. Oh, we can just click on them to walk to them. Didn't know that. Our sprite's back. Let's see, good for you. Collect. And let's do some hunting. Back in the jelly rabbit area. I think Bamboo might give us our job now. Okay, let's talk to Bamba. Day of Destiny. Or to Sage Bamba. Bambama. Okay, we have to be a level 5. I guess that's when we'll pick our job. I'll, I guess I'll end this episode off when we pick our job as a fighter. Let's go talk to Bill. What's this icon? Novice. Uh, that's our class. We're a novice. This guy will probably let us fight some tougher enemies. Yeah, Longhorn Deer is there probably next enemy. Or to Guardians. No, that's what we're doing. Okay. Report. We gotta defeat Longhorn Deer. Okay. Okay, I guess it's just one Longhorn Deer. Okay, thank you. Let's do some vault exploration. Oh, not tough at all for us. Oh, we gotta kill 10, okay. Damaged fur. Oh, I keep pushing the wrong button, damn it. We're sort of in an area where all the areas are meeting here. first episode, it should be long, I think. In my opinion, of the first episode of any game should get you into the whole feel of the game and be long. Oh, there's more over here. Okay, this is where they more are fully inhabiting the area. Let's try using Strike. That. Collect some more from Fault. Alright, we're a bit overpowered for these guys. Like I said, this first area, pretty easy. No one else seems to be over here, though. Like, everyone else who was, like, fighting over there, sort of just still over there. They're not as good as I am, I guess. There's some people talking, I think. Oh, 
well, they aren't. They're just... That's just the... Oh! That guy is. How many more of these do I have to kill? Three. Ooh, wooden chest. Traveling boots. Let's see if those are any better than what we have. Let's see what those look like. Oh, those look nice. There's two more of these deer. We should level up and finish our quest. Okay, let's do this so we can get the next area for that, too. I wonder if you... Oh no, my XP bar is the green bar. And we level up. And it's just in time. Okay, we gotta use our beginner's card. And, oh my gosh, so many quests that we have to complete. Look at this. Oh no, not that one, not that one. Let's complete bills first. other quest too. Okay, we gotta kill some flying dragon babies. Let's report to land it. And it is not in this scene. Ah. Let's complete this quest for Muha. The guy is here. for this place, or what? Oh no, that, it's too under-leveled for us is what it is. I don't know why I went to this guy first. He was so much further. Hi, smiling crabs. Nice smiling at us. I wonder if he'll jump over this song or I'll just walk around it. Okay. Choose your path. Okay. Okay, so we can choose our path now. Let's choose the path of a fighter. I guess. Yeah, let's see. Yep, fighter. Okay, when we finish this, we'll choose... Blueprint Sword Specialist or Axe Specialist. And we'll also get the Grand Fantasia and these things. Wow, this episode's being a lot longer than I thought it would be. So, what did we have to do for this one? mining, and his mining got stronger, I guess. This is being a very long episode. Half of a fighter. Report. Oh, I got a report to Muhu. Okay. And this is Muhu. Gotta choose a reward, that's it. Okay, sword specialist. No, 
don't have enough space in your backpack. Okay, let's see if we can eat something in our backpack. No, that's the item mall. Uh, let's see. Let's... No, these are better. Aren't they? Yeah, the other ones are better. Okay, do we have any bags we can equip? No. What's this do? Focus spell chronicles. What can we do in here? Let's just eat this cookie. Oh, what can we do? Can we sell stuff for the item mall? Sort of blocking my view there. Not can we sell stuff? Do we just take it? Oh. No, oh, I don't get it. Maybe there's a person in town we can sell this stuff to. This is a really long episode. Okay, let's send him to forest hunting. Look at our merchants. It's being sold. Sell ordinary items. Toggle back. said we sold all our ordinary items, but I don't think we did. Do we just take stuff and drag it into here? I don't get it. I don't get how we sell items. Oh, we haven't used this yet. I don't know what we got from that. Oh, we got this. Okay, well that's not important. I think we sold enough stuff. Even though I don't know how it's selling really works. And our guy's back. Oh my gosh. I wish there was a way to like send him on multiple hunts at a time. Select. Sword specialist. There we go. We're a fighter. Okay. Now let's make some warrior equipment. So we need the boots, let's make the gloves. Okay, and let's see if we've got anything new in this book. Yeah, we do. Hot blooded surge. This and this. See our skills. Surge, we don't need any of these weird weakling attacks. Defense expert, I guess that's passive. Rowan chop. And we need charges to do that, I guess. Okay, so I guess this is the end of this episode, so until next time, have a good life, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Grand Fantasia. Bye.